welcome back to the channel 2021 new year new start new beginnings and what better way to start it off with a uh, up close review video and not only that a giveaway at the end of the video as well so i've got a couple of products to show you through this video hopefully they may be of interest to you but let's get them out and have a little bit of a closer look First and foremost, before you've even purchased the product, you've got a really, really helpful sticker on the front of the box. Now, it obviously, gives you a look at the product, um, a description of the product itself, some unique points about the actual product, and not only that, the dimensions as well. So, really, really handy if you're looking to buy some of the organ, you know, the tackle organisers to fit into your rucksack or your holdall. Uh, you know, you get a rough estimate there of the dimensions of the product itself. So you're not going in, you're not buying it blind. You know full well that that if you're going to buy it, that is going to fit in whatever you're going to be putting it into. So always handy. Just a little point that I wanted to point out about the actual product packaging itself. When you open it, it just it comes obviously flat, flat packed. It's so in a little plastic bag, so it's protecting it. Um, <clears throat> it has two large double zips. So if you see my EVA video, it's got the uh, zips on there again with the nice, hard, robust pulleys on them. So you know when it's cold, like I said before, like it is today, you know, you can get hold of them and you can pull it around the zips nice and easy. You're not gonna be faffing around with cold fingers trying to get it undone. Not only that, it's a double zip as well, so you can get it right around the back and it opens up wide. So you're not, you know, you're not just trying to get in and around, you can have it right wide open and see all the contents of your uh, tackle organizer there on show. So one first point about the product itself, the next one, it has a nice clear pocket in the top there. So, you know, you can put all different manner of bits and pieces in there. You clearly see them inside the actual, uh, inside the actual organizer itself. Again, a zip all the way down so you can get your, get your hands in there and have a good rummage around. You know, so you can put packets of hooks, you know, basically whatever will fit in there without putting too much stress on the, uh, on the zip, I guess. So again, another little cool idea. Moving down to the base, you've got a uh, two Velcro dividers. Now, what that allows you to do is obviously set the sections in the uh, organizer to however big or small you want them to be. So you know you can have a short, you can have a short section on the end there, for example, for I don't know needles, scissors, bits and pieces, a larger section. Um, down that end it allows you basically to customize it to however you want it to uh, to be customized to so yeah you can set them to however you want and like I say because they're Valcro you just literally unstick them and re-stick them inside got a nice fleece lining and some padding as well in there which is going to protect obviously the, the bits and pieces that you put in it so it's gonna, you know, not going to rip or tear it's going to keep them nice and padded if it's in your hold or that sort of thing so again similarly to the system select gear which i actually own it's got a nice hard wearing bottom which is handy for when you're uh, you know you're putting it down onto onto ground it's not gonna you know no water or anything like that it's going to seep through and get into the fleecy inside that hard robust wearing bottom is going to help protect that as well um, Similarly, like I say to me EVA video, it's been finished off with really minimal designs. So you know got the the Witchwood logo in the corner there, the Witchwood name logo just on the front. So it's not you know blazoned with camo or anything like that. It's just really subtle logo placement. And uh, yeah, like I say it's quite minimal and exactly how I like my gear really. So that's nice. If you can see on the top, it's got a nice double stitched strong you know it's not a strong handle so if you're putting some bits and pieces in there that are quite weighty you know you might even put leads in there for example you know once you've got a handful of leads in there that does become quite heavy so that's a nice strong strong handle there for carrying around whatever you've got inside this small tackle organizer but uh, 
like I say, that is a small one. I have got the large one here as well, so let's have a little bit of a closer look at that one. But yeah, that is the uh, Witchwood Small Comforter Tackle Organiser. Similarly to the small one, sticker on the front of the box, image of the product, dimensions, description description about the product, and uh, a number of different uh, features about the product there as well. So again, if you're looking at a tackle organizer, well worth looking at what this one has to offer because it is a lot more than the small one. So let's have a little bit of a closer look. So exactly the same if you were to look at it as a small one obviously bigger in the way of size so for example you can see the size difference there um, of the small to the large but looks wise exactly this exactly the same so again starting on from the outside you've got the zips the strong handle the minimal logo in the uh, robust hardware in bottom but the differences are in the inside so Let's get them open. Big double zips again that go right around to the back, which then reveal the contents of the uh, large tackle organizer. Now, as you can see, one side houses one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight zig discs, which are super, super handy to allow you to have number of zigs already pre-tied ahead of your session so you can have anything from one foot up to eight foot or two four six eight ten twelve you know, however you want to make them you can have a number of zigs made up there on these discs and the good thing about them as well is that they've uh, just got a little velcro strip on the back it just allows you to stick them into uh, into the back of the, the holdall and you know they're not going anywhere they're in there tight the zigs aren't going to fall out, the, zig, the discs aren't going to fall out either. And uh, yeah, you can cram them full of zigs, pre-made. You not have to faff around on the bank because I know how how uh, you know awkward making zigs and keeping zigs stored can be. So they are finished off then with a bunch of pins that you can use, like I say, to keep your zigs in place. And just running around the inside of the, uh, the foam disc there. Obviously there's a couple of lips on there to keep them all tucked in and out of the way. But like I say, you can just put them, put the pins inside the uh, discs and that's all flush, compact and neat. And like I say, your, uh, your imagination is your only limit there on how you have your zigs, how long you have them and stuff like that. So super, super handy if you're a zig angler. I'm not, but I can definitely see the benefit of having them in there. Moving on to the middle section, as you can see, mounted through the middle is, what's that, five, five clear pockets. Now, exactly the same as in the uh, small one, you can put whatever you want into these ones. They're kind of zip-locked, if you can see there. Zip-locked that run from end to end, and like I say, that allows you to clearly see exactly what you've got in each pocket. So, you know, you can have, you can have, hooks in one whatever in the other there's obviously your imagination is is your limit on how you want to set this tackle organizer up really so so many features about it using there's endless amount of space in there to be able to keep all different manner of bits and pieces so super handy idea and like i say i don't like sort of having to rummage around when i'm personally fishing so just having those clear pockets to allow you to locate what you've got inside is uh yeah again super super handy now, I have a uh, system select organizer, very, very similar to this, but it doesn't have the, uh, the plastic pockets or the zig discs, but what it does have is this super handy area at the base of the um, organizer. Now again, it's got a Velcro uh, divider, which again allows you to divide up the section to however small or deep you want it, depending on what you want to put inside. It's got the fleecy finish, it's got the padded finish so again whatever's in here is going to be protected and uh yeah not going to be getting sort of bashed about or damaged because it's got the soft the softness of the fleece and 
the padding throughout the sides and the bottom so all going to be looked after once it's inside and not only that you've got a nice sort of I don't know what would you say a third of the base is made up of this big pocket now like I say on my system select one I put in here you know needles scissors um, sharpening stones you know that sort of thing and whatever you want to put in here is just tucked then out the way of anything else that's inside the, uh, the tackle organizer and uh, you don't have to worry then about it flinging around whilst it's in transit so yeah I just tend to put the delicate items in there like I say like the needles and stuff like that where you don't want them bent or sort of damaged or anything like that so just keep them nice and compact inside that little area again as you can see the zip runs the full length of the uh, the pocket allowing you to get that right open get your hands in there and get whatever you need out so then that's a small tackle organizer and the large tackle organizer just two pieces of a very large which would comfort a range so i hope you found that interesting I hope you found the insight to these two products worthwhile if you are in the market for some uh, new luggage then uh, yeah i certainly wouldn't turn my nose up or uh, sniff at the which would comfort a range packed full of features well priced and built to last. So I want to give one of you from my social media, either Facebook, Instagram or YouTube, wherever you are watching this video, the chance of winning the large and the small tackle organizers. So what you need to do is, depending on where you're watching this video, so if it's YouTube, you need to be subscribed. If it's Facebook, you need to have liked my page or if it's Instagram, you need to have followed my uh, Instagram page. So firstly, depending on where you're watching this video and where you're entering from, make sure you are doing, like I say, a like, a subscribe or a follow. Secondly, what you need to do is in the comments, put your favorite piece of Witchwood kit. So, you know, whether that's uh, an old bivvy that you've used for, I don't know how many years or some rods or reels, whatever your favorite piece of Witchwood kit is, stick it in the uh, comments below. But like I say, you must have liked either of my pages depending on where you're entering and uh, you must have stuck your comment in the below depending on where you're watching this video and uh, at the end of January I will choose my lucky winner and I will get these posted out to you personally so good luck happy new year thanks for watching and here's to 2021